Hello everyone, I'm Kaminia. Welcome to my channel. If you are new here, please subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell so that you will be notified for my new tutorial videos. Today I will going to show you how to make this granny square. Star with a magic ring. Chain three. This chain three is counted as one double crochet. Two more double crochet. Chain two, three more double crochet. One, two, three. Chain two, three more double crochet. One. Chain two, three more double crochet. Tighten up the ring. Chain one, yarn over. Double crochet to the third chain. One, two, three. Round two. Single crochet into the space. Chain two. This is counted as one double crochet. We put two more double crochet in the same space. One, two, three double crochet into the next space. Chain two, another three double crochet into the same space. Three double crochet into the next space. Chain two, three more double crochet into the same space. Three double crochet into the next space. Chain two, three more double crochet 
in the same space. Three double crochet into the next space. Chain two. Slip stitch into the third chain. Round two completed. Slip stitch into the next stitch for more skewer. We need to put underneath the V. Let's do it again. Again, slip stitch to the following stitch just for more skewer. Pulling the yarn to the back. Round three. Trench yarn. Slip knot. Attach yarn to any of the corner space. Single crochet into the space. Chain two. This is regard as one double crochet. Another two double crochet into the same corner. Three double crochet into the next space. Three double crochet into the next space. This is our corner space, so we turn to put another three double crochet into the same corner space. Three double crochet into the middle space. We are in a corner again, so three double crochet, turn two, and three more double crochet in the corner space. Double crochet one, two, three, turn two, three more double crochet. Continue this pattern, I will meet you at the end of long three. We are at the end of long three. 
we put three double crochet into the last corner space. Turn one, double crochet into the third chain. For round four, single crochet into the corner space. Chain two. This is regard at one double crochet. We put three double crochet stitch into the corner space. So we need another two. One, two. And then three double crochet into the next space. One, two, three. Three double crochet into the next space. One, two, For the corner space, we need three double crochet, chain two, and three double crochet. One, two, three. Chain two. Another three double crochet. One. Two, three, three double crochet into the next space. One, two, three, three double crochet into the next space. One, two, three. Now we are in a corner again. So three double crochet, chain two, three double crochet into the same space. Double crochet one, double crochet two. Double crochet three. Turn two. Three more double crochet into the same space. One. Two. Three. Just continue this pattern. I will meet you at the end of long four. We are at the end of long four. So we put another three double crochet into the corner space. One, two, three. And then we turn one, yarn over, double crochet into the third chain. One, two, three. Round five, single crochet into the space. Turn two. This is regard as one double crochet. Another two double crochet. One, two. Three 
three double crochet to the next space. Three double crochet to the next space. Three double crochet to the next space. Then we are in a corner. Three double crochet, chain two, and three double crochet all into the same corner space. One, two, three, chain two. Three more double crochet. Then three more double crochet into the next space. Three more double crochet into the next space. Three more double crochet. And then three more double crochet into the next space. Then we are in a corner again. So we need three double crochet, chain two, three double crochet, all into this space. Double crochet one, double crochet two, double crochet three, chain two. Three more double crochet into the same space. One, two, three. Just continue this pattern. I will meet you at the end of round five. We are at the end of long five. We put another three double crochet into the corner space. Turn two. Slip stitch into the third chain. One, two, three. And then we slip stitch to the next stitch under the V. Just for more skewer. Another one to the following stitch. Pull the yarn to the back. 
you can start within the ends. We need a 100 inches length yarn to sew the corner. Go up from this corner. Leave about one inch at the back. Go to the left corner. Go back to the starting point. Go into the middle. Go to the second left corner. Go back to the middle. Go to the far corner. Go back to the middle. Just the young. Go to the right hand side. Go back to the middle. Go to the right hand side. Go back to the middle. Adjust the yarn. Point to the back. Weave the yarn to the second corner. Use the same sewing procedure for the other corners. I will meet you at the end. We have finished all the corners. Turn over. Cut off. Tie it for skewer. And then from this side, that's the starting point. This point as well. Then you can just weave in the, the end.